welcome back to the channel. It's Evelyn here as always. And first things first, a huge thank you to all of you for continuing to support me on this little content creating journey. And an even bigger thank you to all of you for wishing me a happy birthday last week. I had a fantastic week and I'm sure it is in part due to those lovely well wishes. So thank you so, so much. This week, I've been having a look at all those wonderful pieces we created for our spring summer wardrobe series. And I got to thinking, separates like those wonderful things we've been creating recently are absolutely amazing to either create a new wardrobe with a new aesthetic you like, or to revamp your existing wardrobe. So with not wanting to let summer go just yet because I am incredibly stubborn and love summer, I thought this week what I would do is get together those pieces we created for that wardrobe with my favourite purchased pattern pieces and show you how I style them and use accessories to create so many different looks. So without further ado, let's get to some dressing up. Who doesn't love a bit of dressing up? I think everyone does if they're honest. Let's go. All details and links for the garments shown in today's video can be found as always in the description box. Let's start with this tie shoulder top. With the easy to sew 40 shorts that we created earlier on the channel in black suiting, you just add some cute flat sandals and a hair flower and you've created a cute casual yet chic outfit and never underestimate the value of sunglasses. So now let's mix it up. Grab a pencil skirt, like the one drafted in the Legally Blonde video. Usually thought of as smart office attire, but oh no, they can be so much more versatile. Grab some cute gambus trainers and a matching belt, and you've got a cute daytime ensemble, which is so easy to take from day to night. Change up your belt and earrings and add your favourite heels and a hair scarf and look, your date night ready. Changing your lip colour is also a super quick and easy way to update the same outfit to take it from beach to bar. And the exact same can apply to all of those cute summer dresses that you own, just like the anniversary dress. A simple change of accessories and shoes can totally change an outfit. Accessories can really help to make an outfit and here are the ones that are used in today's video but you really don't need to buy a ton. Perhaps stick to a favourite accent colour for a belt, some earrings and maybe some canvas pumps. Some hoop earrings and a couple of hair scarves for example are a great way to start creating a vintage vibe in your wardrobe. And I'll be sharing a bonus video this Wednesday on my favourite ways to style vintage scarves. When it comes to hair, never underestimate the power of an overnight plait or two. I love victory rolls, faux bobs and fully coiffured styles as much as the next vintage enthusiast. But when it comes to dexterity, I'd much rather use any mobility I've got for my sewing. Thank you very much. <laughs> Leaving your hair in plaits overnight can give you a lovely textured wave that looks great in a low ponytail or just down for a simple, easy take on retro hair. A simple plait can also be left to the side or wrapped into a bun. There are so many options. Grab a couple of hair flowers and hey, you're sorted.
Jeans are a summer must-have and I love the ones that I finally created this year after a lot of procrastination. I love the garments and looks that I created this season here on the channel and my wardrobe is definitely decidedly fuller than it was last year. Here are a few more of my favourite looks from this spring and summer setup. And as the weather does grow cooler and for in the evenings, longer length garments like these can prove to be great assets in your wardrobe too.
I hope you enjoyed this little fashion ode to summer. I don't think it will be my last summer content because I just cannot let go this year. But I haven't decided yet. We'll see. As you can see, you really can create so many different looks from just a small selection of garments and a small selection of accessories to go with them. You definitely don't have to spend a fortune. And if vintage style is something that you're looking to get into, definitely give it a go. And if you're already doing so, Let's chat. Let me know your top tips in the comments below. And please, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so by hitting that all important subscribe button below. But until next week, oh, here comes Lena. Come on, darling. Hello. You okay? Until next week, everyone. From Luna and I. <laughs> Take care, friends. Bye bye. Hello. You okay? You're right. Hello, darling. Yeah. Can you come sit? Oh. <laughs>